Sometimes I miss the struggle of the cassette tapes that make me feel old. Mm. You know when you put the pencil no, in and you turn no, around? <laughs> I don't know if you can see this. Let me take this over to the camera. Even I know what that is. Yeah. Well, just, just about. Yep. Oh, this one. Yeah. Okay. Let, okay. Let me turn it sideways. There we go. Who remembers these? <laughs> Who remembers these? Just about. Look at that. The cassette tape. Yep. Yep. You, you know them. I know them. How you know them? Yeah, and I used to pull them out. I was a bit of a rebel. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, yeah. Just give you a bit wow. of example, Robert. Anyway, let's go. It says here, sometimes I miss the struggle of the cassette tapes. That makes me feel old. And that was from Annabelle. Goldie says, I'm listening in the car and the cat was like, what's with that vibe, G? Got him to tune in. Lots of laugh. He needed some breakfast show vibe. <laughs> uh, basically, Goldie's like in a car. And um, <laughs> if you switch that camera, um, I don't know if you can see, there's a cat like literally just listening to the breakfast show. <laughs> like, like... Like just <laughs> do you think he reacted to the lion's roar? I think so. No, this was before the lion's roar, so it's a bit strange. I think he likes the theme tune of the breakfast show. Just like this odd black wow. cat just standing there looking, listening it's to the scary. breakfast show with Goldie. Um, that's interesting. Um, and, and yeah, that's interesting. All right, so it says here, uh, good good morning, Uncle. That was from Olive. Um, this, is that Nanny? Good morning, Aunt Nanny. Trust you all good. Like, what yeah. What happened? It's Nanny. Nanny. I think it's Nanny that she's saying. You like, Nanny? Uh, nanny, no, yeah, Nanny, um, uh, <laughs> Nanny, I'm gonna be here myself now. <laughs> yeah, you know I'm an '80s kid, right? <laughs> so you know, granny, Nanny or someone coming in, you have to like put out your speech. Um, yeah, so uh, um, then we have um, Diane saying the Bobby Louise. Yep. All right, now guys, we need a winner for today. We need a winner today. I rem- I'm, everyone knows about the, the mobile phones. Olive says Tamagotchi. <gasps> Oh, I remember Tamagotchi. Wow. I didn't have a childhood, but I remember Tamagotchi. I used to change the time so I could play it at night time. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. The egg. You hacked time. the Tamagotchi. I did. I did. Olive, I think that's I think that's Tatiana, actually, uh, using um, Nanny Olive's phone. Because Nanny Olive ain't going to talk about Tamagotchi. It's true. Yeah, she ain't talking about that. I, I, that, that tam- but that's a good one. Monica's just laughing out loud. Ruby says, someone at the door. Phew, breakfast is served at the breakfast show. Well done, Robert. Uh, Diane says, and Damara says, my son make me feel old when I see him doing the pull-ups and doing more... Doing more than me, which uh, is you one cannot of be, my you strongest cannot, fitness things to do. You cannot allow that. There is nah, no. I know, right? There is like, like, they no. Just, they just like, they just grow. One minute they're like skinny little things with ribs, and next thing they know they got no, like. But you cannot, you cannot allow your son. To, you need no, to put him in place. No. But know? this is Diane, and Diane, she's a soldier. She used to oh, like drive. I know, I know who this is. Yeah, that, I know. Like, she came onto the program. Yeah, I don't know who yeah, this is. Yeah. you need to one bag your son. You're the yeah, mom. Can yeah, do Diane, this. you know what? You if it was the dad, it would be child abuse. But you're the mom. One bag him. You get away with that stuff. Are you one bag him. That's it. Knock him out. What be done? Bobby Louise. Bobby Louise says, "Well done, Robert." For running the show as smoothly as possible, I love the fact that you did, did you dived into unknown territory for us breakfast show gang. Oh, thanks, Bobby Louise. No, oh. thanks. Wow. Yeah, well done, Robert. You did. Yeah, you, did, you know. Yeah, yeah, thanks, man. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right, uh, Maria Teres from Brixton says hi, Robert, and all from uh, Leandro. Uh, good morning, Leandro. Mary says morning, Robert. Can't believe. I overslept. Well, Mary, you missed the battle. <laughs> okay, the battle, <laughs> the battle of me with the sound machine because Captain Hugo got t- taken away by a black van. What? I don't know if we'll see him again. I just know that. I, was, can, I, 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 can, <laughs> I, I imagine I know who's in the black van. <laughs> I don't know, but Petrina's gonna we'll send Petrina after him. She'll rescue him. All right, Kaya and Ziki says the Cosby Show. Oh my gosh. You know the Cosby Show? Oh, uh, you don't reach that far. You just like uh. mm. the only thing I know about the Cosby Show was a couple of last years. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I mean that <laughs> yeah, situation wasn't good with Bill Cosby. About that. But look, Cosby Show. That's a huge one. That's a huge one right there. Uh, Jeanette says Daddy Lumbar is Ghanaian, apparently. What? Okay, I, I didn't know that. I don't, I'm like Daddy Lumbar, Ghanaian. Hey, I'm gonna check him out. Bob Louis says at Nicole, you didn't go there. How how about happy days? Oh Ooh, my happy gosh! Days. No 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 not that not not I happy hope. days. We we need we, we, Whoopi Goldberg. No like no. We're talking Fonz. I don't know the Fonzarelli. I've, I've heard about that, but I don't know this. Oh happy days, these days are rough. Oh you and me, happiness. you like gray skies, yellow blues. Nothing can hold me when I hold you. Feels so right, it can't be wrong. Rocking and rolling all week long, and like and like and then you have the like the jukebox machine, and like it wouldn't play when he when he wants it to play, he'd just be like, Boosh. and it plays music, and then he has his like motorbike Fonz, the Fonz. No one knows the Fonz. Mm. <laughs> I'm learning today. It's the Fonz. Happy days. Oh, okay. 
the one I know. This. No, no. no, no. This one. transcends Hakuna Matata. It transcends. It transcends. No. What okay, stop. Stop. Stop with the madness. Stop with the madness. Okay. Okay. You know what, Bobby Louise, you went in. All right, then we have Shazad saying VHS and cassette tapes. Yep, and Shazad Taylor, uh, cassette tapes. And Bobby Louise is dropping in Sega. Oh, I remember Sega. I remember playing Sonic the Hedgehog and you had to jump and catch egg, uh, Eggman. I, I remember Sega. So- Sonic 1. I remember Sega. All right, you know, we need to find a winner for today. And you know, you had to, you know, Robert, do you remember when you had to blow the cartridge behind it? Yes. Yeah, yeah before you put it in. Yeah. And you put it. Like, oh, okay. Yen is like. Yen is trying to. No, this is ringing bells. <laughs> Not so, me. Super Nintendo, Sega Mega Drive. Did you have um, the colorful Nintendo? The which one? The colorful one. The Game one. Boy yeah. Advance. Oh, Game Boy. I wish I had one. Game Boy Advance. I wish I had one. I still got one. the original Game it. Boy. Serious? Some of us I had it. You had it. Look, look at the flex. Look at the flex. Yeah. No, no, I'm, I'm nothing can touch Let's the Game Boy. Let's be real. You are balling if you had that. You are yeah. playing original get, uh, yeah. Pokemon, isn't it? Yeah. 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 That's where you had Pokemon, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, yeah. You see the situation. <laughs> All right. Look, guys, this is a, this has actually been a road trip down in Nostalgia Avenue. And um, I'm actually enjoying this. Uh, while Happy Days was the 70s, while Charlotte Taylor knows we're about that one wow so kind is Iki nicole says uh the waltons and the little house on the prairie okay you know we've got to stop now i'm starting to feel old you guys you guys are killing me you guys are killing me but this is a trip down memory lane and you know what i need i, I need to choose a winner do you know what we'll do what we'll do guys i mean i need you to decide on a winner guys i need you to decide because i can't I've, I'm, I've got information overload today you know but yeah yeah uh what's this yeah roseanne oh my days Roseanne, this is like when she was big. She was, you know her as an actress now, but she was a big lady. She had a program that wasn't very popular in the UK, but it was popular in other places with some people on Channel 4, like during the times when we only had four channels. Mm. We don't know this time. We know Sky. That is making <laughs> us, us feel our age when we only had four channels. TV was black and white? No. Okay. It was in color. Okay, not that. And then Channel 5 came later was it with the twisty you had no the twist, even uh, before then remote control and everything four channels and you were at the mercy <laughs> of like whatever they choose to put on <laughs> that's after school was children's itv and you'd watch all your programs and cartoons but when that finishes you have nothing then games master would come on okay i need to stop what? stop 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 okay that made me late i'm stopping i gotta stop i gotta stop you guys have done this atari oh gosh guy nick and cafe says yes happy days i'm not gonna stop stop it guys oh god <laughs> stop it stop it this is Rob, too much i feel like you're trying to go but it's somewhere away. <laughs> <laughs> they're trying to inception yourself back and i'm the- trying to <laughs> like shazad Tony says the big brother on channel four. Oh my, oh my goodness God. That's oh, wow. mess. i remember, you remember yeah, that? yeah oh my i remember, I remember the whole shilpa pomodoro situation <laughs> yeah oh god whoa like, you know what, guys we gotta stop desmond oh no god you remember desmond's on channel four on a rolling street zigzag and a, and, 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 i think and, i remember and, and, zigzag and, 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 and then on London City. And they had the barbershop. Nope. There's an old African saying. Um, what's it? Uh, what, uh, what's it called? Um, they call me Pork Pie. Yeah, man. Nope. They don't make comedy like that anymore. They don't make comedy like that anymore. Yeah, man. What's the show? There's Desmond's and Channel 4. Like, if you go on YouTube, it's funny. It was funny. The Real McCoy. The, okay, now we're going back in time, guys. We've got to stay here. I can't do this. I can't do these things. It's, it's I feel just, like this is a, a, this is more of a feeling old for a certain age group and about. This is. I'm just seeing the. I'm just seeing the two girls. They just. Confused. I know there's things you're like. What is this? this I mean, look, what, what? You, you can feel the vibe of I'm the how, how the essence it. of how it, deep it goes, right? Yeah, yeah like you know, you're like, you're like. Do you know what I remember is on Saturday morning? <laughs> I'm not sure if you guys ever did this. It was Saturday morning, like ITV or something. They had the kids stuff on. Uh, yeah, but the how the bungalow. Go on, Jim. The theme song. Yeah, dun 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 dum and the bungalow. Oh yeah, that that came later though, man. That came later. Does anybody remember the show where the two guys are to me, to you? Yeah, and then no, 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 and then um, Chuckle Vision. Yeah, Chuckle Vision. Chuckle Vision. To me. 
To me. To me. To me. To me. Yeah, they went on for a while, though. Look at that. This is amazing. This is amazing. Look, Goldie says, Monica, Monica, what's that? Monica with the kids growing and Shazad with the reboots. I'm from. Yeah, yeah, I'm t- I'm torn. That's hey, what Goldie hey. says. Um, Shazad says, "Fund the cats." Yeah. Oh, going, I know fund the cats. Yeah. Oh gosh, fund the cats. Catherine Childers, BBC, He-Man. their neighbors. Monica says, "Robert, did you yes, ever watch He-Man?" I used to love with He-Man. They're rebooting, He-Man. They're rebooting it. The they're universe. rebooting it again on yeah. Netflix, and I'm gonna watch it. Do you know they're not doing it for the kids, right? No, this is not for the no, kids. It's not for These them. reboots are not no, made for the kids. It's, it's for me, Shazad, and all the rest <laughs> of us out there who need this in our life. Rugrats. You Rugrats. must know Rugrats. Yeah, I know Rugrats. I never really watched. Uh, Desmond's is now on Netflix. Netflix. Desmond's is on Netflix, guys. Check it out. No, no, guys, stop it. Stop it. You gotta stop. This is too much. Original He Man from Shazad. Uh, remember Desmond's, a Jamaican comedy. Yes, let's stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Sorry, just give me a winner. Just give me a winner, cause I can't. I can't do this emotional stuff. This is like. This is like peeling an onion. All right. I, I worked hard to be like this, and I, I just want to make sure that I stay firm and focused towards the future. I can't go back. I can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> did I did I just did I just do that? It's very dramatic. This is a tough time. <laughs> this one's scary. This goes from the X Files. Oh, that's another one. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> dude. All right, guys. Oh, by the Desmonds, the reruns are on Amazon Prime. You know, I'm gonna watch it tonight just to get my fix. I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do it. Just, I'm gonna have to do it. I've been laughing to myself. My kids will probably won't even get the jokes, but I'm just gonna do it. Look, we need to time out. We need to time out. Yes, there's. Uh, yeah, we need to time out, guys. This has been crazy show today. Yeah, I like that. What's that? It's a gospel. Oh, father of life. Yeah, for since we're gonna do the nostalgia, let's go. Yeah, well, you're going in. All right, look, let's 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 go for a timeout. Green Hill, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! We're gonna come back and we're gonna talk about enhancing our discipline. This is your breakfast show. Ah! Okay, guys, welcome back. This is your breakfast show. I really do apologize um, for um, how I reacted just a moment ago. Um, Yes, and obviously my guests here today, they've um, taken a lot and we've learned a lot. There's a bit of PTSD. (laughs) What? What's that? Post-traumatic stress disorder. No, 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 no. There's no stress. There's no stress. <laughs> no, not for no you, stress. for them. Oh, yes, yes. There's no stress. No stress. stress. There's are no you stress. Guys, are you see? You see this guy, VYG people, that they take everything. They see all kinds of madness happening. Like, hey. they can see fire come from the sky. They're like, we knew that was coming. It's in Revelation chapter four. You know, so they're ready for I every situation. Are we meant to be around during that time? Hopefully not, no. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, I don't want to see VYG lo- lo- members. Lo- 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 lots of crazy things. <laughs> That's the one thing I, I, re- I re- imagine seeing VYG. Oh, I knew that was coming, but I didn't make Oh, look, you know what? That's you know something amazing has happened today, guys. This has been a really different kind of. It's been a different kind of morning. It's been a different kind of show, right? And I'm literally just seeing like where everybody's coming from. Even you two, like you two have tapped into the past. I'm thinking like, especially like you, Glory. I'm like, were you talking like that? Glory's like, older than she looks. You know, I, and you like. I, I thought you was younger than you look, but you're like, yeah, like seriously, like, I'm like this is strong things. Um, yeah, and you got a shout out, by the way. Okay, you got a shout out, Yen. Uh, Shazad's talking about the Burger King video. Uh, Goldie says, we've broken Mr. Robust. He's short circuiting for sure, Shazad. Get the defibrillator, Dr. Shad. You guys remember this? Do you guys 
okay, 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 that's a bit of nostalgia there, okay, uh, yeah, we've all heard that somewhere in some movie, some film, uh, Jeanette at Goldie movie. says, ha ha, okay, Carty, we got it all coming, Knight Rider, that was one of my favourite shows, Knight Rider, alright, I right. think Knight Rider inspired a lot of, I'm not sure if you saw the new Lamborghini Contar or uh, something like that, uh-huh. it's a, cause, I don't know what it is, but we're not the only ones doing this retro thing, yeah. there, there's this idea, for example, Lamborghini recently released, um, they only made like 10 or, 10 or so copies of a car, yeah. And it was meant to be a throwback of something that they released in the 80s. And you can see that, but for a company like that, yeah, to because I, I genuinely thought that the whole retro hype was something that was a bit more like fast, fast fashion. Yeah, Ghostbusters, yep, Ghostbusters, the original Ghostbusters, Chip and Dale. I don't know if you guys I don't know. know if it, switch I the camera, switch the camera. Scary. Switch the camera. The, these, 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 oh gosh, you can't see it. Yeah, you guys you, remember Goosebumps? Oh, you can't see uh, it. Jetix. Uh, Sh- Shazad saying Captain Planet. Oh, gosh. You know, well, let's Captain move Planet. on. I know Captain Planet. I know we need Captain to move Planet. on. We need to move on in this life, okay? So, look, anyway, guys, you know, everybody's a winner today. Everybody's a winner. Everybody's a winner. Everybody's <laughs> getting old. Everybody's getting old. Everybody's a winner. But you know what? It's actually been good because I got to kind of share with you guys, you know, a bit where we came from and you guys are sharing with us and I'm actually surprised by you two um, it's, it's, it's really interesting it's really 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 interesting and I and I, I really enjoyed this and we got a big shout out to the VYG alright Bob Louis says does anyone remember Xena the warrior yeah. that came on channel uh, stop, stop it stop it Xena stop it look alright let's talk about discipline Let's, get, let's talk about this. There were quite a few things that we wanted to cover today on the show that I had prepared. Um, however, due to unforeseen circumstances and a black van kidnapping Captain Hugo and crooking his neck, um, he should return back and should be okay, I presume. Uh, but we had to kind of take the ship and literally myself um, do the show. Okay, so we've got a few things that we had to amend today, but it's been fun. I've enjoyed myself so far. Uh, but we really want to make sure we don't come off subject because today we really want to add something to you on The Breakfast Show. That's what The Breakfast Show is about. We want everyone to be added to. We laugh, we joke, but there's also that side we want to be added to, right? And I don't know, Yen, did you get to have a look at the schedule that I sent? Mm-hmm. I know you requested the schedule, isn't mm-hmm. it? How did you find it? What did you make of it? I was like, yeah, I need to change my schedule. <laughs> <laughs> did it make sense to you? Yeah. I okay. Still, I still need to go back and like yeah. actually do it properly. But yeah, I looked yeah. at it, I said, whoa, okay. Okay. All right. All right. And Gloria, no, we didn't. Okay. Because everybody who sent okay. message the WhatsApp line, Aww. they received the schedule. Okay. Yeah. And uh, the thing about the schedule is this. And, and this is about our discipline, right? And one thing is, like we said last week, you can't keep everything in your head because it just seems bigger than it is and it's hard to structure if anything changes you you in your head it doesn't work there are people that walk around exhausted because they're keeping everything in their head right they're getting they're scraping by doing the things that are most important and this happens to all of us it can easily happen to all of us it happens it's you know what i mean but once you put all those things onto a schedule you can literally hold a schedule in your hand and you can be like, you know what? If I do this repeatedly, I'll become a millionaire. You know what I mean? In two years time. Do, do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You, you know, I need to engage in this thing here. Or I need to start this channel here and start developing this here. Or start, do you know what I mean? You can literally, if I repeat this schedule and make it be my discipline, it won't be accurate all the time. It won't be. Yeah, it's not 100% going to be accurate. There's going to be sometimes you're going to, it won't go to plan life happens right mm. but we do our best to fit that schedule we can literally change our life you know and that's about enhancing our discipline uh we ha- oh gosh you guys are still doing this uh jst is saying jetix yeah but that's not that far back all right it's, that's, it's that's, i don't know for you it's not that far back okay but there, there, there's a place for Jetix because Jetix used to be Fox. I used to like Jetix. Yeah, Jetix used to be Fox, and I was there during the transition period. Mm. They came into our school, explained to us that Fox was going to become Jetix because mm. was, I just remember something. I remember the day that S Club Seven, and I found out that they were breaking up. I remember exactly where I was. I was playing a game called Creatures Two. I was playing a game called Creatures Two. I don't know. They just finished. They just finished. I don't know. They just finished the concert and then they announced that they were breaking up. I don't know. Today it was like you know uh, 9/11. You know how we all remember where we were. I remember where I I was when S Club set. I was born two months later. After 9/11. Okay. Mm. Oh. Okay. (laughs) That's uh, the silence is yeah. killing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It yeah. happened in two thousand and one, right? Yeah, I, I can't remember anymore. 
Yeah. But you know, hey, yeah. you know, life Let's goes on, we that. keep moving, yeah. <laughs> but um, that's uh, how we're rolling, you know. But yeah, anyway, guys, so well, the things that we touched on is set your main goals last week and also set smaller goals, yeah? So make your main goal. Then when you got your main goal of what you want to achieve, what can be your main goal? Your main goal could be the state of your spiritual life, could be what you want to be earning, right? It could be uh, an, an, an asset, like a property or whatever, or a business area, or you want to build a hotel or something i don't know what your main goal is for your family to be in a certain way and you work backwards on the little things that you can do to get there then working via schedule you kind of work towards it so set your main goals set your smaller goals have a defined workspace we spoke about that last week isn't it a place where you can literally focus i think it was yen or you gloria you said that when the place is organized you think better Mm -hmm. right Mm -hmm. you you have more harmony I met a guy last week. He he was not. He was fuming. Mm. I went to Queen Mary's University to see about uh, a certain course and stuff. Mm. And then I was speaking to an individual. It's like, oh, you know, I tried calling up. Da da da. And then uh, I was just speaking to him. It was like, oh yeah, these guys. You know, just because you're on furlough doesn't mean your workload should start to decrease. <laughs> and he's a man about efficiency. You know what I mean? Like, he's a man about efficiency. Like, yeah. So he was just like, yeah, man. All these people they become lazy da, 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 da. and wow. i was like you know i understand that they have kids and da, da. yeah i know they have kids but that doesn't mean that your work should start slowing down look yeah. people are being affected da, da, da. you can see he's being affected yeah. you know and yeah. you can clearly see that he's <laughs> being very affected <laughs> and then he was like you know he, he just wasn't happy about because i think a lot of people mismanaged mm. their working at home yeah. like i know one individual um i'm not gonna expose her but she knows i don't know if she's watching right now mm. but i do know that she works in connect or she works in canary wolf mm-hmm. from home okay yeah so i mean i'll be honest there's certain places where you if you want to work you, you know oh no she doesn't leg- officially legitimate she's working from home until next year um that's just a company thing but she's loving it mm. but she's found that balance yeah but i know more people that haven't yeah we actually have a program actually uh, where we were talking about uh your me- how it can infringe on your mental health uh just not having that work structure you know and it's it's important where our environment is what our patterns are what our routines are it can affect our mental health you know you that guy he was talking about he's probably charged up full of energy you know and testosterone he's just ready to go yeah the guy cycles every you know what i mean white hair cycles everywhere something you know yeah so something like this is going to tip him off the scale he needs to put that energy into you somewhere so you know but this is it so we spoke about having a schedule all right and um obviously once you've got a general schedule um, it says here make a to-do list all right and this is about increasing our discipline so the to-do list is things that for me if you saw my schedule the schedule shows things that I do during the day where I need to be right um, but obviously then each thing you need to do you might need a smaller list to break down which most people generally have most people need to take the ideas and the responsibilities of the day and put it into a to-do list you know um, like my wife likes to send me shopping right yeah my wife Why do you say like that because I don't want to go shopping. <laughs> are you, are you, you? Okay. I don't want to go shopping. I will make her happy and go shopping. Okay. Yeah, and I and I will go into the magic box area in my mind and be physically present. But I'm having time out in my magic box area in my mind. <laughs> Discipline. Discipline. <laughs> Yeah, but anyway, I won't. I won't go too much into that. All right, you're gonna go home to a conversation. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you do? Um, but um, the point is, is um, shopping. So my my wife like says, blah, 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 get blah, blah, blah. I'm like, are you sure this is the reaction you want to have to your wife <laughs> talking to you? <laughs> I was like, oh no, she wants me to go shopping. <laughs> oh goodness, how do I get out of this one? All right, all right. Love talk said I need to make sure <laughs> I deny myself. So and then I the other thing coming happy. into your head: if I do this, John Cena said you can't see me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, now love talk, love talk, love talk. Okay, I have to go. I have to go. Like I learned it on Love Talk on Thursday. So, all right. Yes, darling, I'm ready. I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming, darling. With joy and gladness in my heart. Anyway. But anyway, but you know, um, so so we use it for shopping, right? We use a list for shopping, so we don't miss anything, so we can be really effective in what we're doing. We know what else to go to, what order we go into them. We structure in that way. So is our to-do list. 
whether it's uh, a to-do list like in the home what, what time to do the dishes or certain things we need a to-do list it's very very important it says much like setting goals to make sure you are working towards your main goal it is important to also have daily goals to aid in this and keep track okay guys and here's an last thing i'm going to finish with this one it says take breaks take breaks now here's a, this is huge this is huge because where i come from uh, particularly my generation uh i was even speaking with my, my niece tatiana the other day and she was she was she was saying how um you know she's always doing stuff and she, she broke her leg she busts up her leg and she's recovering right and i said look good you need to rest right and most people think, oh, you don't rest. No, you go on. You blah, blah, blah. You're strong when you don't rest. You know, there's this old, there's this kind of mentality. And many people think, Robert, you know, you, you, you're always doing so much. But guess what? I take time to rest. I take time to rest. Even if I need to do a power nap thing or something, I, rest is as important as what you need to do. Because if you don't, you end up resting permanently because something's gone wrong. You know what I mean? You're out of the game. So it says here, this might seem at first seem counterproductive, but set up breaks where you can step away from what you are doing. By taking breaks, you give your mind time to rest and it allows you to rejuvenate yourself. Set breaks during your work day and do not work when you have not scheduled yourself time off. So if you look on my schedule, you're gonna see there's bit spaces there for time, like me time. So you're gonna see that my schedule is quite busy, all right, there's a lot, but then there's a day where I have this big gulf of time. Now, sometimes I would feel it with something, but I would generally know that's where I can get my rest back and then go into what I need to do. By rest, j just to clarify, because um, I, I know that there's, some people may have a misconception, some people think that resting is spending time with your family and kids, and mm -hmm. but to a certain degree, that could be considered another form of work, correct? It's true. But you know what? For me personally, yeah, you, you, it's. Or oh, do you mean by rest, like generally sleep rest? I'm talking about. I'm talking about just going to your empty mind section and just uh, chill, okay. like chill out time. Have time for yourself. Have time for yourself. Have time, but regardless of how many hours it is, you need time just to kind of relax. Even, you know, if you look at my schedule, I'm meant to go to sleep at ten o'clock, right? To sleep early. Hmm. Some people deprive themselves of sleep. They deprive themselves and they think they're winning. But you know, that, that has implications for your heart to later on, you know, and all kinds of stuff because people don't get enough sleep, they don't get enough rest. Interestingly enough as well, a lot of people a lot of people think have this idea of banking on your sleep. So what happens is they won't sleep for a whole week and they think that if you sleep on a Saturday, you make up for it. But the truth <laughs> is your body doesn't function like no, that. No, it doesn't function. The sleep that you've missed, you've missed forever. And it's your body that was the healing that your body was meant to do then, it's already too late. Drop it like it's hot. So this is a huge thing. It's massive. Like it says here, this might first seem counterproductive, but set breaks where you can step away from what you are doing. By taking breaks, you give your mind time to rest and allows you to rejuvenate yourself. Set breaks during your work day and do not work when you have not scheduled yourself time off. Don't do it. Have you time. It's so important. There are people who know me like well from back in the day and they'll be like, is this Robert? It is. And I've always believed this, even in VYG, even in the beginning of VYG, I always knew God would give me a time to just chill out and relax. And I would realize I'll get my energy back and it will go hard. You know what I mean? So that's it. So I'm going to stop there for today anyway. All right. Today's been a funny kind of Thursday, but I must say I've enjoyed today. I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed, I've enjoyed like, like you guys company and everything like that. And I've enjoyed like you Shad walking through the doors now. Just wish you came earlier. Sorry. Um, and I, 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 we are going to send a search party to go and look for um, honest, Captain Hugo. After the comments you made about shopping, I imagine there'll be have to be a second search party for you. <laughs> Daddy, where's, oh, sorry, Mommy, where's Daddy? Because that's how Kyle says isn't it. Daddy, Mommy, where's Daddy? Where's Dada? He's shopping. <laughs> He's permanently. There's shopping with the angels. There's someone called Jade that said, but you want to eat a... <laughs> she has a fair point. Wait, 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 what's that? What's that? If you scroll up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She said, but you want to eat a... Yeah, yeah it's true. So yeah, you, yeah. you better go shopping so you can eat. <laughs> yeah, 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 true that, Jade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what's this? Goldie says, after seeing the schedule, I needed a schedule. I, after seeing the schedule, I needed a schedule. 
I teach what's that? Goal setting. Yeah. And realize I was preaching what I wasn't doing. Mm. Mm. Lord, sometimes you wonder why you don't finish things. Mm. Absolutely. Okay, and those of you who want the schedule, the you just send a message to me on the WhatsApp line and I'll forward it to you as well with a PDF, okay? Uh Jeanette finishes up. Catherine says, Can you send the schedule again on WhatsApp? Yes, no problem. Just message me. Okay, I think that's Catherine A. Uh Jeanette in Nottingham says, Funny Robert. To go shopping, sometimes we have to do what we don't like. Indeed, you speak the truth. Anyway, guys, this has been your breakfast show, your Thursday breakfast show. A kind of funny kind of Thursday, but it's been great nonetheless because the show must always continue. And now, no matter what black van comes up, we know we could get this show on. No matter who it comes from. No matter who it comes from, no matter where it's going to be, we're going to work this thing out consistently. Oh, yeah. Fly like a butterfly, sting like a bee. That's me. It's your breakfast show, Robert Asher T. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Shad. Tomorrow, we're going to have the breakfast show replay as well on Saturday. It's going to be a replay of the show, so listen in. You can catch us on YouTube, which is youtube.com forward slash C forward slash Robust Life TV. That's the breakfast show. Uh, catch up for you to catch up on our previous shows. And we'll be back live, going hard. No, Monday's back holiday. Monday's back holiday, isn't it? Mm. There's no live breakfast show on Monday. We're going to have a replay of the show, so we're going to prepare that for you. If you've got any requests on what show you like us to replay on Monday, put it here in the live chat when we're going to be on. I'm going to be here listening to the music and typing on some stuff and organizing some stuff for a couple of minutes before I leave the studio. So put in there any show that you want to you want to put on. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right? And um, we'll be back live on Thursday. We're going to be increasing your financial IQ with Maurice Innes. <sighs> I'm done. I'm done. God bless you all. And if you're on the Breakfast Soul broadcast, thanks you guys. All of you, you helped us through. Until then, by the power of Grace Call, ciao for now. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're done. Can you just like switch the thing? Thank you. on the globe start your morning right monday to friday from 6 30 a.m to 8 a.m uk time join robert ashate and hercules your man of sound connect online monday to friday with special guests for inspiration, motivation to start your morning right. Music, banter, fun and laughter. Connect, Connect when you start your mornings with The Breakfast Show. Only on libertyradio.co.uk. That's right, The Breakfast Show is back. libertyradio.co.uk from 6.30am.